నెల్లూరు నారాయణ హాస్పిటల్ లో గ్లోబల్ హ్యాండ్ వాష్ డే అవగాహన కార్యక్రమాన్ని నిర్వహించారు హాస్పిటల్ మెడికల్ సూపరింటెండెంట్ డాక్టర్ బి హరిప్రసాద్ రెడ్డి జ్యోతి ప్రజ్వలన చేసి కార్యక్రమాన్ని ప్రారంభించారు ఈ సందర్భంగా ఏర్పాటు చేసిన నర్సింగ్ సిబ్బంది ప్రార్థనా గీతం నృత్య ప్రదర్శన అందరినీ ఆకట్టుకుంది ఈ కార్యక్రమంలో హరిప్రసాద్ రెడ్డితో కలిసి హాస్పిటల్ అడిషనల్ మెడికల్ సూపరింటెండెంట్ డాక్టర్ ఆర్ హరీష్ లు పాల్గొని గ్లోబల్ హ్యాండ్ వాషింగ్ డే ప్రాముఖ్యతను వివరించారు అనంతరం వారు మాట్లాడుతూ అక్టోబర్ పదిహేను అంతర్జాతీయ గ్లోబల్ హ్యాండ్ వాషింగ్ డే జరుపుకుంటున్నామని తెలిపారు వైద్య రంగంలో సేవలు అందిస్తున్న వారు చేతులను పరిశుభ్రంగా ఉంచుకోవడం చాలా ముఖ్యమన్నారు చేతుల శుభ్రతతోనే మన ఆరోగ్యం శ్రేయస్కరమని చెప్పారు ఈ కార్యక్రమంలో డిప్యూటీ మెడికల్ సూపరింటెండెంట్ డాక్టర్ అరుణ్ కాంత్ అసిస్టెంట్ మెడికల్ సూపరింటెండెంట్ డాక్టర్ సతీష్ చీఫ్ ఇన్ఫెక్షన్ కంట్రోల్ ఆఫీసర్ డాక్టర్ లావణ్య ఆపరేషన్స్ హెడ్ రామారావు ఏజీఎం శేఖర్ రెడ్డి నర్సింగ్ సూపరింటెండెంట్ శ్రీవాణి డిప్యూటీ నర్సింగ్ సూపరింటెండెంట్ కె కాంత కె మాధవీలత అసిస్టెంట్ నర్సింగ్ సూపరింటెండెంట్ దివ్య ఎస్ లోకేశ్వరి సిబ్బంది <coughs> so people who work with me my eyes is not so who are my colleagues they always say that right, this fellow is obsessed with cleanliness because when i go to the patient side right, even in the ward they carry a hand sanitizer hand up with me okay and there is a reason for that uh, do you know why do we give so much importance to hand washing of all the healthcare practices any idea it is important to know because for every 100 admissions 30 patients get infection in the hospital that means 30 of the 100 of admissions they get a new infection in the hospital 30 out of 30 infections 60% that means around 20 are from the hands that is the importance given to hand hygiene that's why They make it a point to everybody practices this and I see. So I would like to ask you about the basic person. Which means, what is the thing which you use for hand work regularly? What is the solution? The pink color one. What is that solution? What is there inside that? What is the main content of that? Alcohol, right? 16% of alcohol. So I would like to ask you, alcohol based solutions are in your hand drug, which is popularly known as, or soap, which is best? Which is best? <laughs> so all of you are wrong. Soap is the best for our hand hygiene. The reason is, alcohol based solutions, they can, they are very good, they are highly effective against you are gram positive and gram negative bacteria, but not against spores. Whereas so also affect against spores. But we practice, we use routinely hand work because the compliance is much better with hand work. Because it is easy to use and it also gives more than 90% of the effectiveness. That is the reason we use alcohol based hand works routinely. So that is the one fact you should know. Only in the middle of matter, next slice to the one minute, next fingers, foot, four months. So these are the things that we in the public health. So infection control of the public health and infection from the hospitals. So if you practice these things, so avail of the uh, toilet when you go, wash your hands of the toilet before me. eating food is lost, properly wash your hands. We have seen many people are eating body pudding. So that person is putting hands and you are happily eating. So most of the amoebiasis and the giardiasis and typhoid fever and infective red stuff to take. So at least when you are going there, the health persons ask you to wash your hands, that person. Otherwise, be away from the They put a hand by the like, put hand by That is what I want to see. When you go to the sink, take it. Or food, 
So when you go, you are supposed to go over the take a hot food and even the about this uh, wearing face masks and the sanitizers. And I am hard to believe that general public are more um, they uh, they have become systematic, disciplined, practicing hand hygiene. Even then, even now, many people are taking hand sanitizers, sanitizers, wearing masks. But I uh, want to believe that doctors themselves don't practice. So the, that's where the importance is there. So as a clinician, then you follow the hand washing practices, clean hygiene. Then only you can impress upon the patients, and patients also will practice. So it is our primary responsibility to practice the hand hygiene systematically. So to teach others. So others to follow, first you have to practice. That's more important. And also, this 2021 theme, why clean hands are still important? Why are clean hands still important? That's what is the theme, this year theme. That, that itself is self-explanatory. It is still important because it is our collective responsibility to safeguard public, public health, prevent infections and promote well-being. So, all of you, as a disciplined manner, start practicing clean hand, hand hygiene and spread this awareness as many as you can. At least if each one of us can at least motivate and uh, inculcate this practice among the general public, at least one, one, each one can at least influence 10 people at least. So that's what the campaign which you have to start. And from this day onwards, take a pledge. Everyone, please make an impact of at least 10 people in the public. So I thought that's what I, so with this uh, small message, so I welcome everyone. And from this day, we take pledge to practice clean hands and hygiene importantly to prevent the infections. So, thank you. Narayana Matrusiva Padakam Ammataraniki Kamanaina Padakam Subaru Padihiru Vandala Vilvagala Narayana BB Health Ketu Uchitam Outpatient School Pratinela Doctor Fizu Uchitam Ultrasound Scanning Uchitam Garbhris Trilu Kanpu Kosankani Itar Ausramai Hospital Lo Chirina Pudu Bed Charge Lu Uchitam Pradhamika Vidya Parikshal Uchitam Mandalu Uchitam Blood Bank Nandu Ausramena Varki Rakta Uchitam Aidunundi Tumidinela Garbhini Laku Pratinela Chakap Samyamlo Uchita Dry Fruit Box Mariu Senaga Chikilu, Chitanga Ibadano, with the portion and with them, Taliki Mudwela Rupail and Nagadu, Amdin Sabadano, Kanpukosam Ambulance, Uchita Pickup Sadupai and Kaladu, Neluru Nagara Paritilo, Nara Yana Matru Seva Padakam, Neluru.